Hello friends, today we'll learn about allergies. Don't scratch your hands like this, buddy. It looks like some sort of allergy. Last night you had too much seafood and beverages with your friend. It might be the reason for this uncontrollable itch. Let me explain all about the allergies. Before we start, apply some aloe vera gel to soothe your skin. Allergies develop when a person reacts to substances in the environment that are harmless to most people. These substances are called allergens and are found in dust mites, pets, insects, pollen, some foods, and a few medications. Allergy symptoms are divided into three categories, mild, moderate, and severe. Mild. Mild allergy symptoms can include rash, localized itching, and congestion. These allergic reactions usually do not spread to other parts of the body. Moderate. These allergic reactions can include symptoms that spread to other parts of the body. Widespread itching and difficulty breathing are very common in this. Severe. Severe allergy symptoms, or anaphylaxis, is a life-threatening emergency in which the symptoms may progress to more serious ailments within minutes. Unbearable itching of eyes or face, swelling of body parts, abdominal pain and cramps, hives or raised welts, vomiting or diarrhea, etc. are some symptoms. These flowers look so beautiful. Consider this pollen is an allergen. Let's see how allergic reactions occur. When it enters the body, it triggers an antibody response. These antibodies attach themselves to mast cells. These mast cells can respond to releasing histamines when the pollen comes into contact with the antibodies. It makes the blood vessels expand and the surrounding skin itchy and swollen. Allergic reactions can involve many parts of the body at the same time. Let's study about them one by one. Nose, eyes, and throat. When allergens are breathed in, the release of histamines cause the lining of the nose to produce more mucus and become inflamed and swollen. It causes the nose to run and itch, and sneezing may also occur. Eyes may start to water, and people may get a sore throat. Lungs and chest. When an allergen is breathed in, the lining of the passages in the lungs and airways swell and make breathing difficult. Asthma can be generated during an allergic reaction. Stomach and bowels. Most food allergies are caused by eight foods. Cow's milk, eggs, tree nuts, peanuts, shellfish, fish, soy, and wheat. Food allergies can damage villi, which are small structures in the gut wall that help to absorb digested food. This can result in diarrhea, constipation, and nausea. Skin. The most common allergic skin conditions are dermatitis or eczema, or urticaria or hives, and angioedema or skin swelling. Most allergic reactions are mild to moderate and do not cause major problems. However, a small number of people may require medication. Now, you know a lot about allergies. Stay tuned for more videos. Bye-bye.